Oh, Laura, how are you, Laura? Hi, fine. And you? I'm great. I'm good. good. How was how was your day today? Um. Well, I have to go. I went to the office and was um uh, tranquilo. How do you say tranquilo? It was okay. It was it okay. Was, I don't know. It was it was relaxing. It was you know. It was relaxed. It was comfortable. Okay. All right. That's great. That's great. You know. All right. What about you, Stephanie? How was your day today? Hello. I Hello. I have a good day. You had a good day? Yes. All right. Why is what why was it a good day? Um not work very much. You didn't work too much, huh? All right. Very good. So why didn't you work too much? You should be working like a slave. <laughs> um. <laughs> hey, Jose, nice seeing you again. Hi. What happened to you? You've been missing a lot of classes. No, no, a lot of classes. Uh, One class is pretty there... too many. Uh -huh. <laughs> no, what happened? Yes, where, where have you been? Mm. How you say more or less? It's so so and more or less. So, so okay. All right, you've been more or less. All right, very good. Good job. So, uh, anyways, that's great, man. That is really cool. All right. One second, guys. All right, so anyways, guys, so uh, welcome, guys. I'm glad to see you here. Evelyn, nice to see you. Where's your camera, Evelyn? There you go, Evelyn, all right. Hey, nice, nice uh, hairstyle. You look like, you look like Evelyn. All right, anyways. All right, very good. Uh, all right, guys, so quantifiers, all right? Let's talk about them, okay? All right, so uh, before we start, guys, so who's heard about quantifiers? Who can tell me anything about quantifiers? What have you heard about quantifiers? What do you think quantifiers sounds like? Say quanti quantifiers, guys. What does, what does that ring a bell for? What do you think? Any idea, guys? Anything, right? You guys tell me. Some, some things no Spanish. That you, some things. Okay, some that things. You, okay. That you can count. <laughs> All right, very good. Okay, so some things that you can count. Okay, very good. All right. Uh, very good. Uh, what about you, Jose? What do you think? Um. Same, it's a uh, counter. Okay, very good. Okay, so okay. same as a counter. Okay, all right, very good. All right, guys, so oops, my camera is off for some reason. Okay, so quantifiers, guys, all right, that's um, you're right. Okay, so it talks about quantity. All right, so there you go. All right, we're going to talk about quantity today. All right, um. What's the objective for today, Stephanie? Uh, by the end of this class, you will learn how to express choices using quantifiers. Very good, all right, very good. How to, ex all right, how to express uh, sentences, actually, okay. So we're gonna go over, guys, uh, quantifiers, and then we have some practice at the end, okay? All right, so let's talk about um, quantifiers a little bit, okay? Now let's take a look at the example that we got here. Evelyn, all right, let's, uh, can you please start reading the exercises here? I mean, the uh, first part here, sorry. 
This right here. Calm down. Are there many restaurants? Yes, there are. There are a lot. Yes, there are a few. No, there aren't many. No, there aren't any. No, there are none. All right, very good. All right, repeat, repeat after me, Evelyn. Yes, okay. not just yes. Yes. Okay. I repeat, no, not no, no. No. All right. So, no, there aren't many. No, no. No. No, there are, there, there aren't, aren't many. Yes. Okay, it's read like this. Okay, aren't, okay, aren't, like this. Um, it's read like, um, aren't, just like this, okay? Um, aren't, aren't, okay, aren't. That's how you read it, aren't. Um, Very good, okay, um, no, there aren't any, okay. Good job. All right, now let's, uh, thank you very much, uh, Evelyn, all right? And uh, Catherine, welcome, Catherine. Jose, could you please help me read the, all right, this part right here. Okay. Long count nouns. Is, is there much crime? Is there much crime? Yes, there is a lot. Yes, there is a little. No, there is, isn't much no there is there isn't any no there is no no very good how much okay all right that yeah they would like there like that okay thank you very much jose all right guys so first of all okay we're we're asking a question here all right and uh where can you identify the uh the quantifier where is the quantifier in this question Tell me. Many. Okay, many, very good guys. So we have many, right? All right, good job. So many, all right. If I say guys, yes, there are, there are a lot. Where do you see the quantifier? A lot, right? Very good. If I say yes, there are a few. Where do you see the quantifier? A few. A few, very good, okay. Uh, if I say no, there aren't many. Where do you see the quantifier? Many, any, none, okay. These are quantifiers. Why guys, because, okay, all right, what do you think quantifiers do, guys? Okay, they help us what? They help, oh. they help us what? They help us, very good, okay, that is all right, the right answer. Okay, so they help us count, okay? Count what, guys? What what things can we count? They help, write it down in your note, guys. Lo deben de escribir en su cuerno, right? They help us write, uh, count what? In this case, it's a restaurant. Nouns, guys, nouns, okay? They help us count nouns. Yes, a restaurant is a noun, okay? They help us count nouns, okay? Very good. So those are quantifiers, guys, okay? Un quantifier te ayuda a contar sustantivos, All right? So far, so good? All right, notice, guys, okay, notice that we have do me a favor, guys, every time that you, if you take a screenshot, guys, every time that you take a screenshot, do me a favor and please send it to the WhatsApp group. I would really appreciate that. Um, so here, guys, take a look at non-countable nouns, for example, okay? So we have two types of count of nouns, right? Countable nouns and we have non-countable nouns. We're going to talk about both of them, okay? All right, so we're going to, vamos a hablar acerca de los dos, los dos tipos de sustantivos que tenemos, guys. Countable nouns, non-countable nouns and you know the type of quantifiers that we can use okay notice something guys okay for example do you see guys you're going to notice that there are some of them that are not here why because you cannot use them with you know you cannot use some quantifiers with non-countable nouns and you cannot use some 
quantifiers with countable nouns, okay? The other way around, okay? All right, so what are quantifiers? Uh, get that, uh, Evelyn, could you please help? No, actually, Laura, Laura, I'm so sorry. Uh, could you please help me read? What's, what's a quantifier? What are quantifiers? A yes. quantifier is a word that usually goes before a noun to express the quantity of the object. For example, a little milk. Most quantifiers are followed, followed by a noun. So it is also possible to use them without the noun when it is clear what we are referring to. For example, do you want some milk? Okay, do you want some milk? Just a little. It's clear that it means a little milk. Very good, okay, good job, all right. Very good, guys, so do me a favor. Everybody, I'll give you one minute. You have one minute, guys, okay? One minute to, oops, right, one minute to give me your own definition, all right? So I want you to simplify this, okay? Give me your own definition of a quantifier, let's go. You have one minute. Tienen un minuto para darme su propia definición de un quantifier de lo que acabamos de leer, right? The fastest that you can in your own words, okay? Right? ¿Qué es lo que entendiste ese párrafo? All right, let's go. One minute. A quantifier is a noun that helps us to know how how much we are talking about. <laughs> of some type of noun. All right, very good. All right, I like your definition. All right. I mean, write it down in your notebook, guys, okay? And then you tell me. All right, I'll tell you when to tell me, guys. You have 15 seconds. Tienen 15 segundos para terminar. All right, let's go. All right, and time's up. Okay, so Evelyn, what is a quantifier for you? Um, Read it. Ya lo tenés que en tu cuaderno, solo léelo. You don't have it there yet? Todavía no lo tenés, ¿verdad? All right, keep writing. All right, Stephanie, let's go. Tell me what a quantifier is, okay? Keep doing it, Evelyn, right? Uh, okay, a uh, quantifier is a word to express things, quantities, or Thanks. things uncountable. No, things. Thanks. 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 Okay, very good. Good job. Uh, Jose, what is a quantifier? Word express quantity goes before a noun and many for countable and much is for uncontrolled. Very good, okay, good job, okay, kind of, okay. The first part, right, a word that explains, the, you know, a, a word to count, okay? I like that, okay? Una palabra para contar, I like the definition, guys. All right, very good, okay. Good job, guys, all right? So that's, you're right, that, that's a quantifier, okay? So let's talk about much, many, or a lot, okay? So guys, we use much, many, or a lot to refer to To what, guys? Big quantities. All right. Many, much, a lot, guys. Big quantities, okay? All right. Now, it says here uh, that we use, you know, we were going to use many, guys, with countable nouns and much with uncountable nouns, okay? I, we actually have uh, a board down here. Take a look at it. All right. And I want you guys to notice. I want everybody, guys, to notice, all right, what's going on here. Okay, so... For example, guys, the word, the noun, pens, okay? Let's talk about the noun pens. El sustantivo lapiceros, right? The noun, the noun pens, guys. Can we count pens? Now, to determine, guys, to determine if, I'm, I'm gonna bring out the white word, okay? So let's talk about, over here, here let's talk about countable nouns, okay? So now let me ask you something, guys. So. Can we count pens? Yes 
or not? What do you think? Yes. Yes. Right? Now, how do I know, guys? Okay. All right. Yes. The answer is yes, right? But how do I know I can count pens? Okay. So how do I know that? So I'll give you a tip, guys. If you don't know, okay, try to say this, okay? One pen, two pens, three pens, okay, etc. Okay. If you can say pens, guys, if it has a plural, all right. So write that down, okay. Very important, guys. Okay. So uh, uh um so hold on if it has a plural you can count it okay so how do you know guys that you can count something how do you know guys that you can count something como saben que pueden contar algo i'm not sure is because it's tangible no, do not speak, guys, do not speak Spanish to me, please, all right? I know that you're trying, but do not speak Spanish to me, okay? So, tangible, that's the word, okay? But not, guys, I will not translate, okay? When you don't know a word, guys, go around, okay? I got, vayan, digan otras palabras, pero no digan español, okay? All right? Because your brain will not get used to English if you speak, if you keep talking like that. So, guys, uh, so how do we know, guys? How do I know I can count? Uh, how do I know? Let me change the, let me paraphrase the question, okay? All right. Okay, so the question for you will be, guys, how how do I know I can count a noun? ¿Cómo sé que puedo contar un sustantivo? All right. If it has a plural, you can count it. What is the answer, guys? If it has a plural? Guys, what is the answer? Let's repeat it. If it has a plural, you can count it. If it has a plural, you can count it. If it has a plural, you can count it. Very good. Okay. All right. So, for example, guys, can I say, can I say one, what is the plural? Let me ask you this, okay? So, following that example, okay, what is the plural of milk? What is the plural of milk? What do you think? Don't have it. Milk. It, so I can say one milk, two milks. Can I say this? Two milks? No, don't have it. No, it's uncountable. Okay. It's uncountable, Bottom. right? So you cannot count it, okay? If you cannot count it, okay? So again, right? If you can count it, right? It is, you know, it, it it is um it is uncountable, okay? All right. So the question here would be, you know, all right. So how do I know if it is a countable noun or not? Okay, if it has a plural, you can count it. If it doesn't, you know it's uncountable. Got it? Simple. So let's go back to the presentation, guys, and I'll give you more examples. Okay. So guys, so. Knowing, you know, if you have cannibal, knowing cannibals versus uncannibal nouns, guys, is very important. Why is it important? Why do you think, guys, that knowing cannibal versus, in, in, you know, and uncannibal nouns, guys, is important? Okay, why? Why this question? I'm asking you a question right now, guys. Why do you think knowing cannibal and uncountable Nouns is important. It's important to talk about quantifiers. ¿Por qué creen que saber la diferencia entre cannibal and cannibal nouns es importante para es importante para hablar acerca de quantifiers? Because I don't can I don't can say for example I can say I can say uh 
I don't have any dollars and I don't have uh, uh, any sugar. Very good, okay, all right, very good. Because, good job, Evelyn, thank you very much. Because of the quantifiers themselves, guys, okay? Por causa de los mismos quantifiers, okay? That's the reason why you can't, that's, that's the reason it is super important to know the difference, okay? Por eso que es importantísimo saber la diferencia entre cannibal versus uncannable nouns, all right? So, over here, guys, okay? So, we can use many, when we are referring, if we say guys, pens, right? We're talking about cannibals, right? So we can use many guys with? Countable. Countables, okay? So uh, for example, you can say many pens, right? You can say a lot of pens. So you can use many and a lot with countables, okay? Write it down. Many and a lot with countables, okay? All right? Now, if it is uncountable, let me ask you something, guys. Can I count? Is is money countable or uncountable? Can you count money? Yes or no? Countable. It's countable. It's countable, really. So why does it say uncountable here? Guys, money, tell me, let me ask you this, okay? Why do you say money is countable? Okay, think money is countable. Money is uncountable. Money, guys. All right. No, guys, money say, is uncountable. Can you say one money? Can you say two monies? Three, three monies? Can you say this? Oh. Un dinero, dos dineros, tres dineros? Uh -huh. No, right? No. Money is uncountable, guys, okay? Uh -huh. So, if I had to say, guys, how... Give me, okay, do me, do me, do me a favor, guys. Do me a favor, guys. Give me three examples in your notebook right now, okay? All right, let's go. Countable or uncountable? Three examples of countables or uncountables, baby. All right, guys. All right, so um, let me know when you guys are ready, okay? Hold on. All right, so I was gonna say, okay, all right. So um, while you're doing that, guys, okay, I'm just gonna write this, type this in here, okay? So you can say, guys, all right, so you can say how, much i was going to tell you how much money or how many money what's the right answer how many, how many? Mm -hmm. remember guys so how much okay so very how good much? guys many all right many and a lot of okay so many all right so if i say many or a lot of these guys is used with many countable nouns, right? And a lot of guys is used with uncountable nouns, right? So for example, you can say 
Give me accountable now, guys. Alguien que me dé un accountable now. Actually, give me your examples, okay? You should have them in your note, okay? Give me one of your examples, uh, Laura. Um. Yes, sorry. Yes, could you please give me one of your examples uh, with, give me one example with accountable now. Mm, pollution. Pollution is countable? Ah, um, I, I hear uncountable. Okay. Heat. Heat. Kids. I mean, heat. No, kids. Oh, kids. Okay, very good. Okay. So you say many, right? Many kids. Let's have a full sentence, guys. Okay. How do we use this in a context? Como lo usamos en contexto real? I, or you can say Laura. Laura, what? How would you say this, guys? Laura? If you want to say kids, guys. Playing with many yes. kids. Okay, Laura is playing with many kids. Okay, very good. All right, Laura is playing with many kids. Okay, good job. All right, good job. Thank you, Laura. Uh, Jose, give me an uncountable now. How much water is in the ocean? Okay, water, right? How you, you asked me a water. question? How mm -hmm. much water is in the ocean? How much water ocean. is how much water is in the ocean? Very good. Okay. Uh, Stephanie, give me your example. Uh, I'm going to wash my hair. I, I want you to use either. Okay. I want you to use, guys. Oh, guys, 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 this is, I'm so sorry. Okay. I made a mistake here. Hold on. What am I writing? Okay. Many and a lot of guys are used with cannibal nouns. Okay. All right. And here, guys, I forgot to add the rest. Okay. And over here, guys, over here is, right, uh, much and a uh, lot of, okay, much, hold on, separate like this, okay, so much and a lot of, okay, so sorry, guys, All right, we're good now, okay. So many and a lot of with cannibal nouns and much and a lot of with uncannibal nouns. Okay, so Stephanie, okay, I want you to give me an example with an uncannibal noun. All right, using much or a lot of, I'm sorry. Um, how much? Okay. You don't need to say how much, okay? First okay. of all, guys, Stephanie, right? Let me let me make this simpler for you, okay? Déjame hacerte un poco más fácil. All right. Give me a noun, okay? Let's start with having a noun. Dame un sustantivo. Que sea no contable, right? An uncountable noun. Um, rice. Rice. Very good, okay? Hey, guys, by the way, you know, this is an ingredient, okay? Ingredients, guys, most of them, okay? Ingredients are usually non-countable, okay? All right. Very good. So rice, okay, let's have, uh, so I can say I have a lot of rice, or you can say I have much rice. Got it, guys? Or you can say, even in negative, guys, okay, you can say I don't have much, uh, I don't have a lot of rice, or you can say I don't have much rice, All right? Very good, All right? Let's take a look at another example. Um, let's see, Evelyn. Okay. Uh, I don't have drink a lot of coffee. I don't have a lot of coffee, okay? Very good. And you can also say, I don't have much coffee, right? Okay. You can say I don't have much coffee, all right? Very good. All right. Uh, give me accountable now, Jose. Give um, me accountable now. I don't have a lot of book or notebooks. I don't have a lot of what? Notebooks. 
I don't have a lot of no notebooks. Okay. Very good. All right. And they give me an example with much, Laura. I mean, with, with uh, many. Mauricio has many cars. Mauricio has many, right? Many cars. Good job. Okay. All right. So these right here, guys, are countables, right? All right. So, okay. So these guys right here, okay, much and a lot of, right? I don't have a lot of rice, much rice, okay? All right. These are adjectives, okay? Because these are modifying a noun, okay? So anyways, okay, you don't need to know that. But much, guys, okay? So we have a lot of, and we have much, and then we have, what is it modifying, guys? The noun, right? This is a noun, and this is another noun, okay? So we have two parts of, uh, we have two parts of this composition, guys. We have the noun, I'm sorry, we have the, the adverb, the, quantify, the, the, the quantifier, right? And we have the noun, okay? So the same thing here, a lot of coffee, right? Okay, uh, much coffee, right? Now here, a lot of notebooks, many cars, okay? And that's it, guys, that is the composition, all right? So far, guys, clear as this, no? Here's a bottle of water. Everything good? All right. Questions? Sorry, I didn't understand about the adjective. I didn't understand the adjective part. You don't need to understand that part. Uh, I was I was just uh, throwing it in there. Uh, there is a class about adjectives. But uh, you, I, I said that the only thing that you have to know is that an adjective I'm gonna put it like this, okay? An adjective modifies a noun, okay? So, a lot of and much is an adjective, okay? Because it's modifying rice. That's all I said. You don't need to know that, okay? Right now, you don't need to know that, but just, just FYI, right? That's, that's uh, you know, a fun fact, right? Okay, just a fun fact. All right, very good. So, any other questions, guys? All right. Okay, so so we have a couple of examples here. Who who would like to help me read the examples, guys? Give me your letter. Yeah. Here are some examples. There are many things to to do today. We have a lot of time. Left uh -huh. and worry. Many people take the train to work. Okay. Much Italian wine is sold abroad. 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 Ah, repeat. Ah, everybody repeat. Ah, bro. Abroad. Abroad. Yes, okay. Continue. She plays a lot of sports. Okay. When we want to it to emphasize a uh, really big em emphasize. Emphasize yes. a really big quantity we can Add so in so, front of so in front yes. of many okay. and much. For example, there were so many passengers passengers of the train. Uh -huh. I was difficult to get to get up. It, uh, it was it was difficult to get off. It was difficult to get up. Very good, okay. She had 
She had so much work to do. She is stay at the office until midnight. Very good. Good job, Evelyn. Thank you very much. Okay, guys. All right. Thanks a lot. So, guys, over here, guys, all right, we have these examples, right? So, you can notice, okay, all right, we're using many because this is a cannibal or uncannibal noun. If I say thanks, guys, cannibal or uncannibal? Uncannibal. Guys, thanks. Remember, one thing, two things. Guys, ¿cuál es la regla para determinar, guys, si es cannibal or uncannibal? What is the rule to determine if it is cannibal or not? Thank you, Evelyn. Thank you. Okay. But it, what is it? It has a plural. Uh, plural. If it has a plural, right? Si tienen plural, guys, it's cannibal, okay? All right. Very good. Very good. So, I'll ask you again, guys. Can't thanks, okay? Thanks is plural, guys. Es plural, right? So, if it is plural, it is? Countable. Countable. Yeah. It is countable, um, okay? Countable. Very good, okay. Can I say, guys, can I say, be careful, can I say many, can I say many thing? Can I say this? What is it, many thing? Many no, we cannot no. say many thing, okay? It has to be a plural, okay? Solo aplica para plurales, okay? Got it? Baby. All right, very good. All right, very good. Uh, all right, uh, so we have a lot of time left. Don't worry. Why can I use a lot of guys? Time. Is it countable or uncountable? Be careful. Uncountable. Uncountable, guys. Okay, all right. You cannot count the noun time. Okay. No puede contar el sustantivo time. All right. People, guys. Many people. Cannibal or uncountable? Cannibal. Raise your hand if you see if you think it's cannibal. Levanta la mano virtual si si pensas que es cannibal. Cannibal. Okay. Yes, guys, it is cannibal. Okay. All right. This is guys. By the way, okay. People is the plural of what? Person. Okay, guys. People. All right. People is a plural of the person, okay? So you say one person, two people, three people. Got it? All right. Does it make sense, guys? All right. So think about it. I think, piensen, guys, que la palabra people is persons, okay? Simple as that. Got it? All right. Very good. So, uh, um, what about the next one? Much Italian wine, right? Is Italian wine cannibal uh, or uncannibal? Uncannibal. Right, the word wine, guys, is uncannibal. Okay, cuando se vino, ya te dije. Solamente cuando hablas de ingredientes, guys, es uncannibal, okay? Got it? All right, very good. Next one, all right, Stephanie, let's read the next one. She plays a lot of, a lot of sports. A lot of sport. The okay. cannibal or uncannibal? Uncannibal. Uncannibal. All right. Now, in this case, guys, okay, it's uncannibal, right? But but sport yeah. does have, you know. Uh, yeah. All right. Well, leave it like that, okay? So, guys, anyways, if you want to emphasize, guys, that something is big, okay? So, si vos querés añadir que es más grande que lo grande que es, right? You can add. So, in front of many and match, okay? You can add what, what guys? So. All right, you can add the adverb so, okay? It's just an adverb, by the way, right? So, it works as an adverb, okay? So, there, are, there were so many passengers, so many, okay? So many, so it's, basically, guys, when you add so, okay, let me give you an example here, okay? So you say, for example, or you say many, right? Let's say that when you say, okay, right, this is, many is right here, many, right? Right? Well, you add so many is over here, guys, so many, right? Got it? Entonces, many, so many is, my, is, is bigger than many, okay? Right? 
That's what the word so does, okay? It's like a, so uh, it's many traffic in soya pango. Exactly, right? No, that's traffic is, is uncannable. So much traffic. No, this is so many. So much so traffic. So much traffic. Yes, so ah, much traffic. Okay. Right? All right. It's like, it's like, it's so cool, guys. really much. Exactly. So really much. Okay, no, that you cannot say that. <laughs> really? Uh, so you can see so much traffic. All right. The one thing that you have to remember here, guys, okay? Uh, this is like, this is like your ex boyfriend or wife or husband, right? An, in, an intensifier, okay? We intense one. All right. So that's what you use it for to give intensity to something, right? So, all right, guys. So this is, okay? That's everything, guys, about much and many. Okay. Now let's talk about a uh, few or a little okay all right i think a few or a little or a bit okay now here guys all right uh can somebody please help me read this to read okay all right read me go ahead uh, a few a little a bit uh, to talk about the small quantities we can use a few and a little. We use a few with countable nouns and a little with uncountable nouns. Very good. It's okay. also... Leave it there, leave it there. Okay, thank you very much. Thank you, Stefan, okay? So guys, remember this. We can use a few with countables and we can use a little with uncountables, right? So can I say, guys, a few water? Can I say this? A few water? Let me have a few water. No, okay. No. Now, also notice, guys, that you can say a bit, okay, with uncountable nouns, okay? So I want to show you something here, guys, okay? A few, guys, is the opposite of a lot of, okay? I repeat, guys, a few is the opposite of a lot of, okay? Let me go back to the whiteboard here. A few. Okay. So when you say, guys... Okay, when you say a few, you know, this is the opposite of a lot of, okay? Es el opuesto, guys, okay? Lo que estamos viendo aquí son los opuestos de lo que aprendimos. Um, is the opposite of a lot, oops, a lot of, okay? And I made a mistake here. Opposite. Opposite. Okay. Okay, hold on. Opposite. Yeah. All right, so if you use the opposite of a lot of guys, okay? And in that same way, guys, a little is the opposite of what? If a few is the opposite of a lot of, a little. Is the opposite of what, guys? Uh, much. Much. Opposite of, very good, okay? Of much, guys, okay? All right, this is the opposite of much, okay? All right, so far so good? All right, very good. So we can say, guys, all right, a few students, right? So student guys, students, I'm sorry, students, cannibal or uncannable guys? Cannibal, right? Very good. Okay. So we can say a few cars. I can say a few kids. What else, guys? A few what? Can I say a few a few, a few, a few friends? A few friends, okay. Very good. You can say I have a few friends, you know, or I have a few friends. I'm sorry, okay. All right, there are a few cars, right? A few students, all right? Now, we don't cannibal, guys. You're gonna use a little, right? So can I say, guys, a little coffee? Can I say a little coffee? Yes, okay, can I say a little sugar? Yes. yes. All right, very good. Okay, so we can say that, okay? Uh, and also you can use a bit, okay? A bit of coffee, but this is informal, okay? This is more informal, all right? Got it? 
And you can also say a little bit of coffee if you want. All right? Pretty good, guys. So, all right. So that's what it's that's a, all. A, tell me, tell me. It's um, 20 years ago. I hear. I heard something say a little bit, a little bit, and yes. her mom or his mom uh -huh. say, "Don't say that." It's a uh, like a offensive war, but now. I see it's a, a common word. Yes. I don't know why the the mom, the, the, the child is angry for say a little bit. Me neither, man. If that's all the things that the kid said, nobody knows that, right? Uh, but that's not a bad word. If that's your, is that your question? If it's a bad word, no, it's not. Maybe he said a little something else, you know? Tal vez se por el compliment, que dijo lo que lo completó, right? Pero no puede ser a little bit. I don't know, she was crazy. That has nothing to do with grammar, okay? <laughs> Uh, okay. But yeah, man, good story, good story. All right, guys, I uh, do you want to play a game? No, if you if you don't say anything, I'll take that yes. as a no. All right, very good. Let's play a game, guys. So what we're gonna do, guys, is all right. I want you to read this, and this is what we're gonna do. Okay. So Laura, help me read, please. Exercise. How much or how many? Spin the wheel and determine what the right answer is. Very good. Okay, guys. So what we're going to do, guys, is that I'm going to spin the wheel, or le voy a dar vuelta la wheel, and whatever word you land on, en la cualquier palabra que caiga, right? Vos me vas a decir, ahí va, va a estar, voy a elegir alguien, alguien, right? And I'm going to say, you're going to say how much or how many, okay? Okay. Or you can say much or many, okay? Got it? Me vas a decir si usas many or much. Yes? All right, very good. So let's spin the wheel. All right. Very good, guys. So first one, okay. All right, so let's see who is, who goes first, okay? Cars, all right, good job, cars. So, Laura, quickly, cars. Countable. Uh, no, ma ma many. Many what? Many cars, okay, all right. You have to give me a sentence. Me tenés que dar una oración, all right? I How have many, many cars. cars do you have? Very good, how many cars do you have? Good job, all right, Laura, good job. Okay, next one, Jose. All right, for you, Jose. All right, let's okay, see. Okay. Apples, let's go. You can send us with okay. apples. How many apples uh, is in the store? No, is. Are. Apples is plural. Are in the store. Very good. Good job, Jose. All right, great job. Stephanie, let's go, Stephanie. Milk. How much do you milk? How much what? How much milk? How much milk what? In the How much refrigerator? Milk? How much milk is there in the refrigerator? Oh, is there in the refrigerator? No, refrigerator. <laughs> Refrigerator. 
All right, kind of. Thank you. All right, good job. All right, Evelyn, let's go, Evelyn. All right. Let's see what we got, Evelyn. Butter. All right, let's go with butter. How many? Do you know what butter is? Thank you, butter. Do you know what butter is? Uncountable. No, but do you know what it is? Thank you, butter. Yes or no? Mm, no. Butter looks like this, okay? Butter okay. looks like. No, no, guys, do not speak Spanish. All right. Butter looks like this, you see? All right, this is what butter looks like, you know? And, and then you have some spices um, over here. Much. All right. All right, very good. Okay, do you know what butter is now, Evelyn? Uh, es como la margarina. Okay. So okay. remember, guys, guys, I said ingredients, right? Ingredients are non countable, guys. Okay. Are Got not countable. So, all right, so let's try it again, Evelyn. Give me the example. Okay. Uh, how much? Huh? Bar how much butter? Very good. How much butter? Butter. Do you have? Do you have? Very good. Good job. See, very good. Okay. How much butter do you have? Quanta margarina tenes, right? No, it's not. It's not margarine, guys. Okay. Uh, I don't know how to say it in Spanish. Okay. I don't. I really don't know. All right, very good. All right, next one is uh, Nancy, right? Nancy, you're next. Love. Love. How many love in my family? All right, let me ask you something. Can I say, can you say I have one love? two loves three loves okay can you say this can you say this yes or no 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 puedes decir tengo dos amor tres amor cuatro amor right no all right very good so what is the right answer guys how much love do you need right cuánto amor necesitas okay got it very good all right, good job, Nancy. All right, uh, Catherine. Oh, Catherine, I think. Catherine, can you speak? Yes. Oh, okay, I'm sorry. I thought that you were not, that you were driving. That's why I didn't ask you anything. All right, music. Uh, I... Uh -huh. I no sé. I like uh, music. No sé. I like a lot of music. You say a lot of music. Good job. I like a lot. I like it a lot of music. Or you can say I like much music too. Right. Very good. Good job. Great job, Catherine. All right. Pretty good. Uh, so let's go back to Jose. All right, Jose. Let's go. Art, okay, let's talk about art. Art. All right, give me your example. Mm -hmm. How much art is in a museum? Museum. Is in a museum. Good job. How much art is in a, is it in a, is in a museum, okay? All right, is there? Uh, is there in a museum. Good job. Good job, Jose. All right, Stephanie, right? Let's go, Stephanie. Give me your answer. Sugar. Uh, how much? How much? How much uh, sugar in the house? 
is there in the house. It's, Good job. Okay. It's there in the house. Good job. Thank you, Stephanie. Good job. All right. Next one. Uh, Evelyn, right? Evelyn, what water? Let's go with water. How much water do you need? How much water do you need? Very good. Good job. All right, you're getting the hang of this, guys. All right, uh, Nancy, right? Let's go, Nancy. Don't worry, you'll do this time. Advice. Will you say? Advice? Uh, yes, advice, like this. Advice. I don't know. All right, so is it is it how much advice or or is it how many advice? What is it, Nancy? Advice. Advice is when somebody's giving you, you know, good tips for your life, for example, right? Consejos. Ah, okay. Ah. Uh, how many? No, how much, guys? Advice is uncountable, okay? How much advice, okay? It is uncountable. Very good. Good job, Nancy, right? Then Catherine, right? Catherine, let's uh, let's have your example, Catherine. Bananas. Uh, okay, I I have many bananas. I have, very good, so it is I have many bananas, very good, good job. All right, and lastly, right, uh, Laura, coffee. I drank much I coffee drank, today. I drank much coffee. All right, I drank much coffee, very good, good job, guys, and applause for everybody, guys, good job, okay? Applause, 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 guys, okay? Very good. All right, guys, so, uh if you need to review your class guys remember that you can always watch the videos on youtube right si necesita revisar una clase guys remember right recuerden que pueden revisar youtube guys all right to rewatch the class okay and uh um, that's it right do you have any questions guys do did we understand everything entendimos todo guys tienen alguna pregunta easy peasy uh i have a question no 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 but it, uh, in the platform? The platform, platform? No, no plataforma, uh, platform, okay. But in the platform, in the letter B, it is uh, in the number, in the second part, number one. <laughs> the okay. answer is, for me, is studying. With okay oh you're talking okay, right. let's let's okay let me pull up the platform and then we will go over that okay uh, hold on la platana forma all right hold on <laughs> all right very good all right so let's uh let's take a look at it okay so that is from what section did you say uh letter b section two part two and number one section two okay right. from uh-huh for me the talking. answer is a study okay let's see so which one two point what so it's two point what give me the the number no me tira numerito solo Dice letra B, complete conversation, parte, eh, parte de. I have no idea where, which one you're talking about. I think she said part five. Sí, said, parte cinco. Section, section five. five. Section, section five. Cinco. Okay, all right, section five. All right. You said section two, right? Right, ah, no, no, no. Es que la sección 2 de la parte 5. I don't understand in Spanish. Very good. Uh, so, uh -huh. so, 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 which B. B, which, we, what do you mean B? There is no B here, guys. What do you mean? ¿Por qué no le tira B a mí? Dice, B, 
complete conversation. Are you talking about the final exam? Is she talking about the final no. exam, guys? No, no, no. Okay, okay, no. Okay. This, this is B, complete conversations. This is the final exam. I think that you're ah, talking about okay. this, okay? So which one are you having? I think. And the part two. Uh -huh. I... Part two, uh -huh. which one? Uh -huh. uh -huh. Is uh -huh. she uh -huh. part two. Starting. Is starting. Uh -huh. is she Pero starting? Me, me lo tiran. Me lo tiran negativo. O sea, ya no le Spanish. puse un montón de veces. Y... No Spanish. No, español. A mí me lo tira bien. So, te has equivocado en algo. Si me lo tira bien a mí, estos son los servidores, mm. right? So, te has equivocado no. en algo aquí. Quizás no Maybe le pusiste. Maybe the spelling. Quizás no le pusiste eh, uppercase here. Exactly, right? Mm -hmm. Or the spelling. Mm -hmm. o, le, oh, okay. la, o si le pones un espacio extra aquí, tampoco te la va a dar, ¿ve? Uh, so, you have oh, to okay. make sure that, okay. right? You have to make sure that you don't have any extra spaces or anything, okay? No le, o no le pongas punto, ah, eh? tal okay. vez le pusiste Thank punto, you. no sé. Did it work for okay, you now? Okay. Thank you. All right, very good. Did it work? ¿Te funcionó? Ahorita voy a intentar. All right, very good. Meanwhile, guys, do, does anybody else, all right, does anybody else have any other question, guys? Are we good? All right, guys, mm -hmm. necesito que terminen toda la plataforma ya, okay? If you have any questions, please send me a message, all right? Thank you very much, guys, and enjoy the rest of your night. Bye-bye, guys.